My party people, my friends, welcome back to the basketball season finale! Today, I am showing you the entire playoff. You heard that right. We made playoffs, okay? Regular season, we won one win, three losses, and we still somehow made playoffs. Mwah. Playoffs, game review. If we win this game, we're literally playing the championship game right after. I'm tired of losing. Let's do it. First play of the game, Zach Jibbleson finds me. I have the shot. I'm not too confident in it, so I take it back out, drive to the hole. That's my specialty. Get the bucket. I refuse to lose. Raging Ginger has the ball. He shoots up an air ball. I catch it, and I want to win so bad. You know what? I'm like, I'm gonna have to score. So, you know, I, all my teammates want the ball. Spin move, I go all the way for the lamp. I don't pass, it's selfish, I don't care. <laughs> that reminds me, we're doing a point counter. That is four points in two possessions. We're running a man defense. The opponent gets the ball. I contest the shot, they miss it. He gets the rebound a little bit, throws it while he's falling out of bounds to Kyrie Irving behind the back. Oh, just kidding, that's just our teammate. He lost it doing the behind the back. Then it led to them getting the open shot. But that behind the back dribble was not it. I'm just going to say it. Zach dribbles at the ball on the right side. I come in for the screen. He gets the wide open three-pointer. Clank. Unfortunate. Zach Roth coming down. In and out move. Sees Jidel wide open. Takes a second to pass it. Jidel drives in. Knocks the kid to the floor and gets the foul call. After James gets fouled, we get the inbound down low. So I run straight to the post. I'm like, James, give me the ball. The one thing on my mind is attack the basket. This dude can't guard me. Attack in the rim. Another two points. Thank you to whoever said woo. We do our defensive specialty, leaving people wide open. Not sure how that happened. He misses. Throw it to me. Give me a big shot. came down for a floater and I don't know how that's a foul bro I don't think Jidel really touched him and Jidel's reaction says he didn't touch him but the other team hit the first free throw and the second free throw was also good the game was pretty back and forth at this point very even score right here dribble god Jidel has the ball dribble dribble takes one two three and gets blocked and they call a travel let's analyze this in slow motion picks it up one two three i don't know okay it might have been a travel in slow motion right here this dude thinks he's steph curry just pulls it complete confidence misses i gotta take the ball from our teammate i'm like that's mine and then right here behind the back cross that's a pretty nice move get in and then i don't know how the ball just went flying out of my hands and i just completely missed it the other team threw it to us, then I was already down low and this kid fouled me. Pause. Why this dude jump like that? I look like I'm flopping. I have a lot of questions. Off the inbound pass, Zach gets the ball, sees our big man, open for the three, and he shoots him. I gotta give him some nice claps too. Right after that play, your boy gets subbed out. Very sad, very sad. I wish I could play the whole game. Our team inbounds it literally to his defender and then they just get the easy layup then we're dribbling up wide open shot for a brick like i subbed out and everything started going very badly all of a sudden things were not going well they do a pick and roll he takes the three misses it james is just standing there the dude gets the offensive rebound james hustle hustle james i don't want to lose literally in this play just watch zach <laughs> zach just Yeets him to the ground. James hands off the ball to Zach. Zach and Jidel pick and roll. Zach sees the opening for the three-pointer. He's a shooter back rim. That's the worst to hit back rim. They pass it to their lumberjack. Guy gets James jumping. Goes in. Gets fouled on the floater. The other team has a fast break. He goes in for the layup. Skeets it. He skeeted it. We get the ball back. I'm already up the court. I catch the ball right here. Euro step. One, two, three, four steps. And one. Ah! I've been playing basketball for years. I don't know what that should be. Like, he fouled me in my Euro step. Euro step, I got him. He just decides to grab me. And you know what? Like, I'm just like, I'm gonna keep going until I shoot it. So I shoot it. I may have taken four steps, but I got the and one out of it. Point counter. We are at 11. Hit the free throw. Let's make that 12. Nope, never mind. They pass it to glasses down low. Man takes the hook fade away. I get the rebound. And then I'm going up the court. I notice they're about to foul me, so I yeet a shot. 
and I almost make that. Oh my god. He fouled me before the shot, but I was just trying to yeet it. Imagine if that went in. Pretty much the reason they fouled me, it was nearing the end of the quarter, and if you foul someone with like 10 seconds left, the refs are too slow to inbound the ball within those 10 seconds because it's a running clock that the clock just runs out. So the cheese is just to foul someone. First quarter, it's a very even game. I play some health defense right here. James goes up there. I see this guy open. I was a little late. My fault. He hits the three in my face. I run down to the post. They're like double teaming me. I get the ball. I see my teammate on the wing wide open. I pass it to him and he fades while he shoots it. I don't know why. I tip the rebound to myself. Grab that. I see James and I'm like, James, give it back. I'm in the post. And James pulls it and hits it. Okay, John L. Bro, look at James's little celebratory run. Lumberjacks got the ball in the corner. He sees his teammate wide open on the wing. He dribbles on, turns our teammate around, and gets the foul call. Right here, our big man is dribbling up the ball. You know, I see he has the ball. I run to the free throw line. He passes to me. Double team. I spin through them. Go for the shot. Get the foul call. First free throw. I miss it. Very sad. Second free throw. Redemption tour. Nope. Okay. My free throws have not been good. We really need these points. I can't afford to miss free throws. I'm hurting my team. I'm dribbling up the ball. You know, simple right to left crossover. Go in. I hit this dude. I want to be and one. I get an offensive foul. I average about three offensive fouls a game. I've never averaged offensive fouls in my entire life until this league. They're doing a light press, so I'm like, pass me the ball. Right when I get it, I gotta pass it to Zach right away because he has some good positioning. Drives in. Really nice pull-up jumper from Zach right there. Zach inbounds it to me, and I'm thinking, attack the basket right here. Dribble around the charge. Then I knock it to the floor with the post and get the foul call. Literally, like, I get fouled probably by multiple people right here. Like, this dude karate chops into my arm. And then look at this dude's reaction. Free throws once again. Another brick. And another brick. I am letting my team down. That's five points off free throws I've missed. Right here, the other team. Good passing right into the post. And my guy goes up for the shot. Gets a weak foul. And, you know, while I was missing my free throws, the other team spent time making their free throws. Very disappointing. <laughs> I'm posting up. Just watch me do my signature play. How does that make you fall, bro? Are you that weak? Possession after he might be hurt from falling on the floor. And he, he airballs the shot. We get the board. Passes it to Zach. Zach drives in. And somehow they call a travel on Zach. <sighs> I think Zach was a little mad, so when he saw the the ball, he literally just manhandled it out of this kid's hands. He had to get his anger out. Honestly, I like I'm not sure completely what our teammates were doing. We got an air ball right there, and we can't even get back on defense. My man's at like half court walking, so his man's absolutely wide open, leading to the layup. This is playoffs, okay? You cannot walk up the court. The effort on our defense right there was a solid negative 67,000. The halftime is coming to a close. We are down by six. I cross in. I have the open three. Take it. Replay. At halftime, though, the score was 24 to 27. They were up by three points. Only three points, bro. We can win this. Point counter. I might have forgotten one of them. I'm not sure, but we are at 14 points. Second half starts out with them shooting a three-pointer, Jidel giving us a rebound, and us getting a big strike. Boom! 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 Triple replay! Dude was pissing me off the whole game, this ginger dude. In and out cross. Bro, I made this dude do a freaking 360. And then I have the three-pointer off the dribble from it. This dude comes in last second. It's too late, mate. The ball's already up in it. They get the ball right here. He dribbles in. Jidel, amazing help defense. Allows me to tip myself the ball to get the rebound. And then I see this dude. I, you know, I slowly dribble, try to get him to foul me a little bit. Three of them on me. Spin move, left-handed shot. It's in. Right here, James warns me there's a pick left. We double team. He throws a horrible pass. And just their luck, this dude has the most amazing pass and save to this dude for the three-pointer. Like, what kind of luck is that? They get the offensive rebound again he's in the corner will he make two straight threes no he doesn't i get the ball time to put on the dribble moves i see this dude i'm thinking double behind the back i pull off the first behind the back then pause look at my foot my foot is about to get screwed okay the thing was the reason why this sucks so bad is because this is what happened on the inbound play oh 
Oh my god. James was excited to pass it. He stepped in bounds. <laughs> oh my god. First of all, I just want to say this. I will not tolerate any Jidel abuse. I'm his brother. I'm allowed to talk about Jidel abuse. Any mean Jidel comments, getting banned from my comment section. Right here, Zakharoth wearing the nice orange shoes. Dribbles down. No one decides to guard him, so he takes the pull-up three and misses, unfortunately. The other team is going down, finds a shooter wide open for three, and they hit their shots. Zach has the ball, crosses, goes in. I try to give him some space, so I go out to the wing. Down step, one dribble, side step. I made a basket, you know what's gonna happen. Did that three-pointer really mean that much when we forget to guard players on their team so they get a wide open three-pointer and it just equalizes it? This is about to be an interesting series of events, so get ready. The ginger guy gets the ball, I get screened, so he gets a crazy floater to go in. And then we're walking up, and he hooks my arm, and throws me to the floor, and they call a foul on me! He hooks my arm and yeets me to the ground. They call a foul on me and him. Double foul. I got hooked to the ground. After that, Jidel has the ball, jab steps, takes the three, and almost makes it. Good shot, or almost it's not a good shot, but. <laughs> Zach dribbles in, finds me on the wing, and my teammate is so wide open, like, I, I have to pass that, and he gets blocked! People on these videos always be like, Jessery, why do you never pass? Okay, first of all, I do pass. You know, I get scared to pass when things like that happen. <laughs> Bro, what made James that mad? Just starts stomping and sprinting. This might be for the first time ever, but I'm giving the other team a base drop. No fear he blocked him and caught it all at once. Like, in basketball, if you can, like, block someone and catch it right after, it's a god play. This is where things kind of start started going bad. You know, after a team has a god play, it's kind of what you expect. Pump fakes him. Other team gets the three-pointer and it goes in. Possession right after, you know, I made most of my threes. I was feeling hot, but I really took a bad shot. Like, that was pretty contested. I'm in the post right now. I see our teammate out of the ball, so I run towards the middle. I actually get fouled there. I miss, and it goes to Zach for the and one, so it worked out. Give Zach a base drop. Yeah, can we be Zach made an amazing block, but somehow the dude got the ball and made the layup. Zach crosses in, drives in, finishes with his left. Really nice shot. Defensively, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know what our team was doing. I'm on this dude, and we're just leaving them wide open. Like, there is no defense being played. At this point in the game, they're up by like 10. They just keep scoring. We can't stop them. There's only so much me, Zach, and James can do. And Joe Buys Holmes decided to not show up for the fourth week in a row. Right here, I got the ball. I put the dribble moves on this kid. Dribble by him, knock him to the floor and get the foul call. It led to the inbound pass, went right to Zach. Zach sees an opening, drives right in and gets fouled. Zach's free throw, first one is good. Second free throw, that one is also good. And then what, the, what, what? What, why is James on the floor? We have to analyze this in slow-mo. I think he got hit in the face and just gave up on life and just fell to the floor, but like, you can't do that. You know, when you're on the floor, your man isn't being guarded, and I'm just assuming that was James's guy. And, you know, going into the fourth quarter, we were down by 11. 50 to 39. Things were just not going good. Someone's suddenly out on our team, and it's like, okay, I understand. You know, people want to play, so I was like, all right, I got to go to the bench. And then our team just goes really downhill once that happened. And then Zach's like, Jess, you got to get back in the game. Jess, yeah. Jess. And then they got another layup, and I was like, all right, that's enough. I'm calling a timeout. First possession back in the game. Quick cross behind the back. I got him pretty good, and then he fouls me, and I miss it. But it's redemption time for the free throws. Hit the first one, and I hit the second one. Time is really running down at this point. If we're going to make a comeback, it starts now. And ladies and gentlemen, it did. Believe that. Zach gets the ball. Passes to me. One jingle. Side step. 
Bang! Let's go! Comeback season, boys! What's that? What's that? Point counter. We are at 27 points, ladies. Things are going our way. No one is guarding the dude down low. Zach comes in. James's guy gets the ball. James steals the pass, gets the steal, and you know, I just run into the defender a little bit so James can get the wide open layup. Good play, James. The refs are just inexperienced. Like, right here, that's a travel, man. It's just a clear travel. We're down by a lot at this point, guys. Our season's coming to an end. Our defense is just so bad. <laughs> like, come on, man. You know, James gets fouled, hits the ground. The game's coming to an end at this point. James is wide open. I say, nah, let me get this foul call. You know, let me just get some more points. You know, ending it off. 29 points. We lost by 12. Final score 64 to 52. The end of the Turquoise Turtle season. Hope you guys did enjoy this series. Thank you guys for all the love on it. Uh, you guys are really hyped for me to bring this back. Look out next year. Gonna bring it back again. Check out the other basketball season videos if you haven't already. Click right there. Click the subscribe button. Tell your friends to subscribe, please. Road to 3 mil. I love you guys and peace.